Hello and welcome to this quick Power BI tutorial with me, James from Matador Software, where we're going to be looking at a really nice workaround to show more than two items within the Power BI advanced filtering pane. So we can we can take any example when we use the filtering pane and we've got, let's say, a product ID, you always have the option to go through and use the basic filtering. Now, that may not always be ideal because quite often you may want to show if you're presenting items more than one condition, for example, or you may be wanting to show several different product IDs based on certain criteria or conditions. And there's, as standard, there's not really a really swift way to do this when presenting data. So usually when we use the advanced filtering pane, we have two conditions we can sort of state. So we may say is less than equal to, greater than, is a certain value. Um, so for example, here you could just say it's greater than the product ID of 10. Potentially products one to 10 were just test values in our, in our transactional system. Um, and we could say is less than or less than or equal to a certain value. And if we filtered the data within the, the advanced filtering pane, we can sort of show a set of results like this. But what if we wanted to show products greater than 50 that met a certain criteria? Well, as standard, you would have to go through the basic filtering um, because you can't do it in the advanced filtering pane. But then that presents certain issues, like if new products came along, if we maybe didn't have a product idea of five, it came along later, how do you automate that? So really the best way to do it is to go through the advanced filtering pane. So I'm gonna show you a really nice workaround as to how you can add more than two items there um, and present and, and show sort of the data and insights with power. So here in the basic filtering, I can just select four random product IDs to get those four conditions I'm gonna need um, in my advanced filtering pane. So for example, I could say where the, the product ID is less than 30, and then maybe I can use the or keyword here, and I can just show a few different product IDs. Maybe we also, there was an important criteria between 40, 41, and 42. And you'll see that now I can successfully filter using the advanced filter pane with, you know, four conditions. So equally, we could go ahead and we could select seven items and show seven conditions. It's it's really up to you how you want to use this, but it's a really nice workaround. I've seen it on several great sites. I've seen it on in a Formu blog, uh, mentioned on different blog sites and in the in the Power BI forums. Um, so as usual, if you like this content, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thank you.